I think one of my favorites is uh, when I did an exhibition of Marjorie Schick, who was a faculty member at Pittsburgh State uh, in Pittsburgh, Kansas. And she was nationally and somewhat even internationally known as a, an artist doing wearable art. And uh, very exciting, colorful work. We did that in the new gallery. She had a friend she'd gone to school with in uh, Indiana. And this friend uh, had married someone that had a business of uh, laminated uh, wood products, specialties uh, paneling. And evidently it was a fairly successful business. Marge asked uh, or told her about the exhibit and she wanted to come and see the exhibit. And she did, this lady. And when she got here, she was impressed with the new building and that we had a big name architect do the design work on it. And she was also impressed with the gallery uh, programming and so forth. So after she uh, had returned back to Indiana, she spoke with her husband about uh, the possibility of them giving something to the library. And that gift turned out to be the large stainless steel sculpture that's clear on the northwest corner of the library. Oh, okay, yeah, sure. The Library of the Year Award, which was, what, a couple years ago now? Probably more than that, I think 16, wasn't it? Yes. Yes. And uh, that was a big surprise that Topeka, who probably most of the United States has never heard of, mm -hmm. <laughs> received that honor. And I didn't think about it until Gina, uh, our librarian mm -hmm. now, said that, well, you were part of that. We didn't get that just overnight, that you and other staff members that have worked over the years mm -hmm. bringing this library up to what it currently is have been part of that. And okay, <laughs> that was fine. <laughs> uh, I, I really enjoyed being part of that.